And this is happening here in the United States. Federal court upholds ruling blocking construction of the Keystone XL pipeline and other oil and gas pipelines. So what happened was, uh, and I'm sure you were following this some, Gordon, there was a, a big pipeline called the Keystone XL pipeline that was going to go through here in the United States. Uh, Trump okayed it. It is um, that pipeline, along with some others, go through some native lands. There have been protests. One of the big protests was the Dapple protest. And finally, the federal court has upheld the ruling blocking the construction of it because it's already leaked multiple times. So, it, it, so let, let me uh, let me ask you this to kind of draw it back to um, to draw it back to our our, our, our cross uh, our, our cross cultural uh, analysis here. I know that fracking does go on in England. Uh, is it as isn't as it is as is it as dominant as it is here? No, uh, but that that's not to say that it isn't a problem. Mm -hmm. From I, I looked a little bit into this fracking business, Ron. It's a mm -hmm. big part. This fracking business is. It's another Ponzi scheme, isn't it? It's yeah. Another, it's another one of these things where actually, if you look at the companies who are involved in fracking, very few of them, very few of them actually make money. And they get a lot of money thrown at them. They just, um, and I yeah. I haven't seen the, the, the details of it, but whenever you get into, there's a guy over here. Um, sorry, I'm probably going off, off topic a little bit heavy, but there's a guy over here. I think he's the richest man in the United Kingdom. Maybe some, some people watching this can, can double check me on this. But he's actually taking Scotland to court. He's taking them to court to get Scotland to allow him and his company to frack in the Highlands in Scotland. Oh, that's nauseating. That is nauseating. Some of the most beautiful land in the world, I the know. Highlands, and, and, the, and they make beautiful things like whiskey. <laughs> it's just come on. And, well, well, Scott, so you you can't scratch uh, the Scotland of flat out bandit the, the 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 fracking, but he's taking them to court right now because he wants to obviously open Scotland up to his business and make money. I mean, they're already doing it in in England. There was a place in I think it was just outside Manchester. Actually, you mentioned Manchester. Is it just outside Manchester? I forget. I love that town. Of it now. Um, but uh, I mean, they had to close this fracking place down because as soon as they turned this, the, the gas on, there was earthquakes all over the place. It's like, oh, you, the earthquakes. Have you, really? You, the, in America, there's this place. It begins with P. And, and Jess Sessions, he, he, was the, he was the guy there. They, they started doing fracking and all of a sudden they got lots of earthquakes for some reason. You might be thinking of Pennsylvania. That's where Pennsylvania, I'm from. Pennsylvania, that was yeah. it. That's where I'm from. Yeah, so I mean, there was a load, of, and as soon as they opened it up for fracking, all of a sudden the earthquakes went through. The, I, I wonder why that is. Yeah, well, the way we do it. That is. But uh, to be honest, Ron, I think it's right. I think what this world needs more of, going back to the Keystone, is oil. That's it, it needs more <laughs> oil. It needs more oil, more gas, more fossil fuels burnt and thrown into the atmosphere. That's what it's it been needs. helping us if out we're so go far. Out, we might as well go out with a bang. <laughs> do it well. That's what I say. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the way we do it here, I mean, getting back to the Ponzi scheme thing you said, the way it goes down in the United States, there's all these third party contractors that they just throw all this money at. They exploit the environment completely. All of this so called energy, first of all, it's like, I, I forget. Someone made the analogy. Um, oh, man. What was the guy's name? Stephen Machat. He was a guy who ran for office in Florida. He made this analogy on my show, and I loved it so much. Um, he said, like, fracking in general, it's like it's like blowing up a person's body to try to get them to fart. <laughs> and, and it just and it makes zero sense. And, and, and what little, quote, unquote, energy you get. First of all, we should be getting off fossil fuels. What little energy we get. They send all over the world. So whenever they make the argument in the United States, which our politicians make and, and the people who justify fracking try to make that, it's like, oh, well, we need it for our energy needs. No, we don't, because none of that quote unquote energy even stays in the United States anyway. It's just shipped off elsewhere. So the only thing you're doing is padding a CEO's pocket and you're just wrecking the environment in the meantime. And, uh, and that's how the system is. So in the United States, it's not just like, Oh, we need to think about our land. It's this is a business opportunity for the one percent, and that's why other countries like Scotland and England have a much better response to this than the United States. Y'all aren't perfect, 
No, but y'all no, are a lot no. better. And when you first said, I didn't know Scotland had a straight up fracking ban. I'm thrilled to hear yeah, that. They, I'm not 100 percent sure, but I think okay. they did. I, I know he was taking them to court. He's like the richest man in in the UK. Well, when you first said that they've actually banned it, based on like the fluidity of our conversation, I thought at first you were saying they've banned whiskey, which I really <laughs> panicked for a split moment. I was like, we got to get over there and protest. Are you kidding? <laughs> they can't do this to us. I don't. <laughs> my, my 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 nerves and they couldn't take that at the moment, Ron. No, they can't do that. When, no, when, when okay. they when they when they said that off licenses over here were were essential businesses, we all breathed a huge sigh of relief. You don't want to. My heart can't take that. <laughs> <laughs> do you know why? Uh, do you know why? Like multi malts and blends are so popular to Scotland and not Ireland. Do you know why that is? uh no so i learned this on my whiskey tour in edinburgh okay. and to their credit this was edinburgh telling this story so basically it's as simple as in scotland they were trying to get like they were just doing single malt whiskeys you know like how it all began mm -hmm. and theirs was just not as good as what ireland made and no matter what they did like they could not get theirs as good as ireland so eventually they were just like, well, uh, we're just going to make something else. And they started blending a bunch of stuff and they had trial and error. Sometimes they would make something. They were like, wow, this really sucks. Other times they were just like, this is great. We're calling it scotch. And that's how that's how it happened. That's brilliant. It, we need it all came that. down to right. I mean, they were just we like, well, innovative. yeah. And they just said they were like, hey, aces in their places. Ireland, they got the single thing down we weren't going to be able to touch that so we did our thing and and now you can enjoy everything isn't that great and we were just like yeah i mean that's that's the recipe for world peace isn't it you know that's beautiful, just like, man. Just like yeah, we, I, I love it i love a scotch wish i love a i love a nice uh, a nice scotch so um, me too i started at a mate. huh it's my drink I like oh whiskey. well you know i i got into like the the scotch blends early and the it's the nerdiest reason in the world. When I was, um, when I was about like 13, uh, maybe even a little younger than that, there was a movie that came out. Uh, I'm sure, you know, goodwill hunting. That yes. was, yeah, yeah. You know, the movie goodwill hunting. So yes. the guy who it's did the theme. Fault. Yeah. It's not your fault. Yeah. yeah. It's not your fault. Ron. It's not your fault. Will. <laughs> <laughs> but the guy who did the theme music for that is Elliot Smith. And, uh, you know, rest in power, Elliot Smith. But mm -hmm. um, the song was called, like, the title track was the song called Miss Misery. And the line goes, I'll fake it through today with some help from Johnny Walker Red. So when right. I heard that song, I had to go out and get Johnny Walker Red. And that became my drink when I was, like, a teenager. And and then I just got used. And now I just kept drinking, you know, blend. Sophisticated, man. This it's, a, it's a sophisticated <laughs> drink. Yeah, yeah. You, it, it, it means it means you're a man of man who is worldly wise. That's yeah, what it, what I like to think anyway. Well, as my, a teenager, I was just like, oh, I'm deep like Elliot Smith. I'm drinking this, you know. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> like... <laughs> my my um, my granddad used it used to be my granddad's drink. So that's that's why I sort of you know caught on caught on to when I uh, first started many years ago when I first started drinking, um, and it stuck stuck with me. Yeah, man. And uh, hey, we're all better off for it, aren't we? We were talking about the Keystone Pipeline. <laughs> <laughs> so they I don't blocked know how it. we That's got good. the segue from Keystone Pipeline to whiskey, but. Well, you know, one is the nectar that may we keep forever. The other is the nectar that may we be rid of forever. That's oh, there, you go. I, I, there I, you go. There you go. I couldn't agree more. I there really, you go. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> Get your news on with Ron. Don't you want to know what's going on? We're getting our news on today. Get your news on with Ron. Don't you want to know what's going on? We're getting our news on today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can tweet me an article at Ron Placone. We'll go through it together and make it our own. Get your news.